let's go welcome to the next episode of the forest where we last left off we took it on the chin but lucky for us this time we're just going to rewind it a little bit and i'm starting to feel like you know there's aspects of this game speak of the devil that you know it's starting to show kind of the earliness um of the build not that there's anything wrong with that but um i think you know, we're going to shoot a few more episodes of this and do some more exploring. And then I feel like we've kind of given it a good look. But we're going to talk, you know, the other thing I want to mention before we get started in this episode is that. Okay, we need to run for safety. The other thing is that um, this is the second video of the day and, it, you know, it's coming out super late. It's actually we're going to probably come out like around like 1 a.m. Um, but it is two videos a day. It's not the ideal timing. But like I said, if you watch, I don't know if you watch the Isaac video, anytime I travel to speak, it really kind of messes with my schedule. So I, you know, that's one of the things I got to work on. But just to give you, let you guys know how important it is to me that we hit these two videos per day goal. You know, it's fairly late right now in recording this, but, um, you know, I don't know. It's just something that's important and I want to stick with it. And I hope you guys enjoy this as we press forward. All right, so we need to find something to eat here. Enough about that stuff. So let's go ahead and we have no bars to eat. Stores energy. Crafting. Health. We need to cook something. Oh, how about the bird? You die, sir. No meat, though. All right. So we got to look for... Unfortunately, we're pretty desperate right now. We need to look for some kind of candy bar or something of that nature close that what is that thing looks like hairspray all right so this is kind of like the poor man's version of the shell game i guess you know pick a shell any shell snack that's what we needed how much uh okay gave us a little bit so we are going to farm these things and I think this game has a lot of potential. I mean, it's it's kind of, there's some, you know, like I was a little disappointed with our view from the treehouse, unless we just maybe have to chop some stuff down. Um, I'm still trying to actually figure out what happens when we die. There's some money there. Cash collected. All right. And I feel like there's a lot of, uh, a lot of the crafting stuff that we haven't even got into yet, which is fairly exciting. What's this? We don't want any more booze, sir. You're cold and wet. Get a fire. Do we get two for one on that? Yes, we do. A lot of meds. We're good. So we're really just trying to harvest some food here. I like that there's no enemies around. That's very heartwarming. All right, this guy's gonna, we need to eat. See, I feel like we should be able to eat that. Make some turtle soup. Just saying. Like, I, I feel like with a game like this, you can't be, oh. That was creepy. I say, I feel like a game like this, you can't be selective in terms of what you can kill and use and what you can't use. Pretty much, you have to be able to use everything. And that's game design 101 <laughs> with Dan Geesling now. What do I know? All right, we need to go ahead and build a fire here. Actually, we do have a fire over here. We just need to go ahead and, and redo it. All right, so let us press forward here. See what's around the corner. It is a little chilly or cold and wet, that's okay. Just as long as we don't get in a fight with those individuals. All right, no one's around, good. Let's go ahead and get our fire going again. Let's see if that's gonna attract them. All right, are we dry now? E. Good. All right, let's go ahead and 
catch some Z's in there. Hopefully we're just going to hit it once this time because I feel like whenever we hit it normally. Oh, baby. Let's go ahead and save it here too. So we're going to save. And then I think it's, it's now finally turning daytime. We're cold and wet. Keep that fire going, buddy. All right, let's go ahead while we're doing this. Let's go work our way back to our little clubhouse that we built. Maybe we can... What's that? That's new. What is that? Sticks and skull. Um, we're going to try and chop down that tree that kind of messes with our our view, and I'm hoping that we're going to be okay. I do like the fact, that's cool, that they put two home icons there. So that we, we don't, you know, it's not like the last one you, you sleep in is the one. Alright, so let's, we're going to chop down all trees and see if we can get a better view going. Because we put a lot of hard work into our... Oh, we're tired. Say, we put a lot of hard work into our... Uh, our chateau there, so we want to make sure that we get the most out of it. Why is this tree null and void? There we go. That's some good shots right there. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, one more. Wow. Okay. So I think this one is going to be the last last one that's messing with us. I'm going to go out on a limb and say. I wonder if they haven't thought about it. They should put a chainsaw in this game. Because that would be fun in its own right. Just go, going around. You could just call it deforestation or the deforestation I would play that I bet that's very rewarding okay well, why did that noise up oh, there we go no oh, man piece of garbage go run what's who's hitting us wow we're about to die you I think this marks the end of the forest. I mean, yeah, we get all our stuff, but that's how I. Th that's how I feel right now. Well, <laughs> this is essentially the closest to rage quitting we're going to get. I hope you guys enjoyed this short look at the forest. We're going to have a talk on the next vlog about this experience. And I'm, I'm not saying I don't recommend it, but it's got a long ways to go. And, uh, yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, I encourage you to hit the like button. Hitting the like button helps for the video, helps for the channel, helps for the face, and is maybe not going to help this series on the channel. I'll see you guys next time.